Hey, welcome to my clinical book. As I always say, reading is to mind what exercise is to body. Mallory Weiss syndrome was initially described in 1929. Mallory Weiss syndrome is characterized by the presence of longitudinal superficial mucosal lacerations called as Mallory Weiss tears. These tears occur primarily at the gastroesophageal junction. Mallory Weiss tears are one of the common cause of acute upper gastrointestinal bleeding. Kenneth Mallory and Soma Weiss in 1929, described this condition as lower esophageal lacerations, not ulcerations, happening to patients with repetitive forceful retching and vomiting following excessive alcohol intake. Retching, also known as dry heaving, is the reverse movement, retroperistalsis, of the stomach and esophagus without vomiting. Heavy alcohol ingestion is considered to be one of the most important predisposing factors as in about 50% to 70% of the patients. Hiatal hernia was found in a considerable number of cases with Mallory Weiss syndrome. In 85% of cases with Mallory Weiss tears, the presenting symptom is hematemesis. The diagnosis of Mallory Weiss syndrome is usually confirmed with endoscopy, specifically esophagogastroscopy. There is only a split, or tears, of the mucosa near the gastroesophageal junction are seen. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel for more medical content. Don't forget to share this video with others who may benefit from the information.